Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Tuesday evening drive. So, I'm not driving yet. I'm about to hit the road. I'm gonna stop by the post office, check the P.O. box, and I'm gonna stop by the bank. But before I go, before I hit the road, I wanted to start off like this just to give you guys a little taste again of this like vlog style thing. I'm really not used to it, but I kind of like it. I'm kind of thinking about changing the series a little. So last video, I did the what I got for Christmas video and it was more of a vlog style and you guys seem to really like it and I love creating it. So I got a question for you guys. Let me know in the comments what you think. I'm thinking about making Tuesday's video more of like a vlog thing and taking little videos throughout my week and kind of showing you guys basically what's going on throughout my week. And I don't know, some weeks it might be like really interesting, some weeks it might be like boring, but I don't know. I thought it could be fun, but the only thing is I'm thinking if we do that, oh right, I gotta look at the camera. You guys were telling me um, when I look right here, I'm looking right at you guys. So this is where I gotta look. I don't know, I just keep looking at the screen. I gotta look at the camera. Um, and I don't know, maybe I need to get a vlog camera. But, I don't know, hopefully the quality on this is okay. But yeah, but I'm thinking if I do that, the vlog style thing where I'm just like showing you guys what's going on during my week, there wouldn't be a lot of time for questions. And, you know, I was thinking, you know, that might be good. And maybe there's like another place that I can do like Q&A stuff. And that's another question I had for you guys. Like, do you have any ideas of um, another way we can do like Q&A stuff, maybe I could just do like periscopes and we could do periscope Q&A and then Tuesday's video would be more of like a vlog, what's going on throughout my week. I don't know. But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think we should make Tuesday more of a vlog thing? I show you what's going on in my life or should we just leave it the way it is where I'm driving and talking and answering questions? I'm cool with either, but let me know what you think in the comments and if you have any other ideas, let me know too. But yeah, my car's warming up. I think I'm ready to go. So let's get this going. Here in my garage, you know, just with my car getting ready to leave and uh, filling up a flat tire. <laughs> Here's a little little sneak peek into my life as well. Um, yeah, so the tire probably doesn't look too flat to you. I started filling it up, but I was like, you know, I wanna show you guys uh, this process. So every, every few days or so, I gotta fill up my tire with this air compressor. Can you see this? Yeah, this is hard. Okay, there we go. There we go. This is hard to do with the camera facing at you. Um, but yeah, every few days I have to refill my tire because it slowly deflates. And I don't think there's something in it. I don't think there's like a nail in it or a puncture. Um, I've been told that it's, I have these like alloy wheels or something and it gets corrosion or something over time if I don't wash the car a lot. I don't know. But what I do know is that I have to refill my tire every few days. And it's very unpleasant, especially in the winter when it's freezing out. Um, I'm actually considering getting a truck. I haven't mentioned this before. I'm considering getting a truck and trading in my car. It's more practical in the winter in Michigan because, dude, the winters can get really bad. I don't know when that will be, but it's something I'm thinking about. Yes, yeah, so this is a little sneak peek into my life. Um, so yeah, tires should be ready to go. Let's get on the road. Okay, so let's get into the questions. You guys sent some great questions in on Twitter. So anybody who's new to this series, what I usually do, what, I, what I've been doing with this series is asking you guys on Twitter, what should we talk about? You send in the questions and I answer them. So that's kind of what I was talking about at the beginning of the video. Should we change things up? and do the question and answer with some other thing like Periscope maybe or something else, something to think about. So first question was from Steel Tech. He said, where's Rocket League, Kappa? So he, oh, speaking of Kappa, I'm actually wearing my Kappa shirt. You may have seen it earlier. Um, but yeah, where's Rocket League? So I think it's coming back. So the reason we haven't done a Rocket League video in a while is because uh, of the holidays. It was very difficult to get everybody's schedules lined up. Also, okay, I'm at the bank already. <laughs> also, Jay has had company over here. I don't think he's been streaming or recording or anything. Um, so we really haven't had a chance to do any recording, but um, I believe, I believe we will resume very, very soon. I don't know exactly when. Wow, this is the brightest thing ever. Just finished up at the bank on my way to the post office. And actually I haven't been there in a couple weeks. 
So there might be a lot of stuff there. We'll see. Um, but yeah, so let's keep going with the questions. Next question was from Sammy. And Sammy said, um, do you have any plans for 300,000 subscribers? We're almost there, guys. We're at 295,000 last I checked. So we're almost at 300,000. I'm planning on doing something a little special. I want to do, like the last one I did was 100,000. And I did kind of like... Uh, best moments kind of thing and I think I want to do that again and maybe add something else in there too I don't know but I haven't even started on it and those videos take a really long time so it'll probably be after I have hit the 300,000 mark for a while uh, but I am planning on doing something special for 300k uh, great question. Next question was from Kara. Curious Kara said, Are you going to any conventions this year? Oh no, sun's about to be in my eyes again. Uh, are you going to any conventions this year? I already have my PAX tickets. Holy crap. You know what I just realized? I got a problem. Oh, we got a problem. My mic is hanging from my visor, so I can't put the visor down. <gasps> like, look at this. The mic goes down with it. Oh, this is bad. Okay, I'm gonna have to have the sun in my eyes. <laughs> Um, I got my PAX tickets, I got my PAX hotel, and yeah, I went to TwitchCon last year, maybe I'll do that again, but I really do want to go to more conventions because they're really fun, I love them, I love meeting you guys, I love hanging out with my YouTube and Twitch friends, so yeah, um, plan is PAX East, possibly TwitchCon, maybe more, I don't know, maybe if, dude, if MineCon comes back to the US, maybe I'll go there again. Um, next question is, oh, Relish, Relish Relisher said, how do you deal with regret? And I think this is a cool question. I love, I love talking about, uh, you know, real life stuff like this, that it's something that everybody deals with at some point. And something that I've learned as far as regret is you want to move on. You know, it's, there's two things. You want to learn from whatever it is, and you want to move on. So the faster you can do that, the better. And with any time you regret something, it means that you wish you did something differently. So that means there's something to learn from it. So learn whatever it is, uh, whatever it is, learn from it, and remember it, learn it quick, and then move on. Because if you hold on to regret, it's just never good. Holding on to regret does nothing good for your life. It does absolutely nothing. What does do good for your life is learning from mistakes, learning from regret, moving on, and having a positive outlook on the future, knowing that it doesn't matter what's happened to you in your past, that doesn't determine how good your future is going to be. And I know this kind of sounds like, I don't know, motivational speakery or something, but it's the truth. It's really important, um, but yeah. And how do you move on? Like, yeah, how do you move on from regret? One of the biggest things is just stop thinking about whatever it is you're regretting. Because you, you have control over your mind. Like, things will come into your mind, but you have control whether or not you're gonna dwell on it. So, something pops into your mind and you're like, okay, that's in the past, I already learned from it. It's not gonna do me any good to keep thinking about it. Let's just think about something else. Think about just whatever you want. Think about something you're excited about. So that's, it's just crazy because our mind just by nature wants to dwell on negative things and you have to have control and say, no, I'm not going to think about that. Change the channel. Boom. I'm thinking about something fun. <laughs> um, so I'm no expert in this. I'm just telling you what I've learned from uh, experience, what I've learned from others, what I've learned from books I've read. And yeah, so that's kind of my best answer for that. And the last question was from Blue Man Clarinet. Do you have any goals for your channel for 2016? It's kind of my same goals every year. Just continue to improve and become the best I possibly can. Make the best videos for you guys as possible. I want to just, I want to think of new ways, um, new things to add into my videos and do things that haven't been done before. And it's kind of tough because with all the videos that, that have been uploaded on YouTube, you'd almost think everything's been done, but it's not true. There's a lot of things that haven't been done, and I don't know, that's that's an exciting thing for me um, when I think about YouTube and video creation. You're only limited by your imagination. So 
I, I just want to think of new creative things to do for the channel and definitely want to grow of course and keep uh, you know just keep being a positive impact on people's lives and yeah so those are some of the main goals for the channel but guys that's gonna have to do it for today like I said earlier in the video let me know in the comments what you think should we do more of the vlog style um, where I show you guys what's going on in my life or do we just keep it the way things are you let me know in the comments but that's gonna have to do it for today if you guys enjoyed the video as always feel free to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next Tuesday evening drive what? You gotta be kidding me! He just guessed Chow Tzu! Okay, he just get, guessed Chow Tzu. Who do you think knows more about Dragon Ball Z? Piccolo, baby! <laughs> this is this was sent to me in one of my uh in my P.O. box. I did a...